Okay, so, um, okay, so we're back. That was, um, I don't know why that happened. This has happened to me a couple times with, uh, Windows 10 now, um, where just the start menu and the sound will randomly stop working. It managed to keep recording my, uh, my voice, my mic, but the sound, not just in the recording and ops, but the whole sound <laughs> on the computer just stopped. And, um... When, even when I opened the sound configuration, nothing happened. A start menu would not open. I got Windows 10. What I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to... I'm gonna probably go with this one for 20 minutes and try to clump it in with the first 10 minutes of recording. Just cause I don't wanna just make it... I don't wanna cut out the la the, 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 the beginning of this episode, which wasn't a lot, but I want to give you the whole experience. Um, but yeah, so sorry about that. That was weird and uncalled for. On the part of this computer, I blamed the computer. Anyway, let's get back to business. I was gonna tr see if I could buy some large Titanite shards from him. I think he sells them? Yes. He sells them, and I have just enough to buy one, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop a soul and upgrade my what's it. I don't know how many I'm gonna need. I think two though. Wait, no, that's not it. Um, let's see if I can. Okay, I only need 400. Okay, so now my claymore is at plus 10, and that means I can upgrade it. Ooh. That's right, I can upgrade it to, to, once I get the soul of Artorias or Sif, that's much later on. I can upgrade it to, I can downgrade it to a plus five Claymore. I don't want to do that. I can upgrade it to a Lightning Claymore. If I take it to, if I get a larger, if I get a uh, very large Ember, I can take it to our friend Andre and upgrade it to plus fifteen. I don't really care to do that. Um... Because by then I'll probably have a weapon that's better than a fully upgraded Claymore. So we're just gonna we're gonna see how we fare against um, against uh, Barkley and Booty uh, against uh, Wolfman and Fatty. I'm sorry, Lion Knight and Fatty with uh, this goofy thing. Uh, that's right. I totally switched to the Plank Shield for a reason. So finally, our goofy little cl big boy sword. Can do is um, above 200 in the damage department. You're just gonna. Oh, you fucking asshole. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. Usually by that point, he's already taken out his stupid little. S oh my god, you fucking prick. That's it. Oh my god. Usually by then, he. Oh boy. When I get that close, he usually just takes out his stupid sword and starts swinging at me. They usually... Oh my god. Oh my god. They don't usually, um, keep the stupid bow out when you get super close range. Cheese it! There we go. Okay, well that was an embarrassment. Um, anyway, before we continue, I'm going to take an unnecessary sip and open a necessary door. Okay, one. Geronimo. Ground roll. Okay, screw those guys. They'll probably get over here and hurt me very badly, but first I want to open this door. Do, 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 do. Oh, God! Boy, howdy, this is awkward. Okay, that's the door. That opens back out to uh, Disney World. This is where the entrance to the building was. Let's get the hell out of here where it's safe! Oh, God. Okay. Okay. So these guys are not that different from the big from the other big knights we fought earlier, but they have a couple extra powers. These guys can heal, 
And um, usually if you get too close to them, they will use Wrath of the Gods, which is, um, it's a spell, well, it's a miracle. So it's a white magic that um, emits a shockwave that knocks you away and also does a lot of damage. Crud. And that's it. And it's got a lot of range. Oh boy! That one almost caught me off guard. Let's get a stupid shield up. Oh boy! Darn it, I was trying to roll, but my stamina was still reloading! Eat it. Okay. Now. I'm out of Estus. I've got only got one enchantment left. I'm not going through that boss door just yet. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna use this black eye orb to search for the world of the guilty. What do you want? What do you want? Me and my bag seek justice. So, welcome to the world of La Trek, the Guilty. La Trek of Karim. He's kind of a dick. So, clearly, he is the Firekeeper's killer. Naturally. Um, well, I don't know how natural that is of you. Anyway, he, he, he is the killer. You get to invade his world, which is invading players' worlds, obviously. It's, it, it all takes place in the same in-game world, just on a different server. So we are in Night Latrex server, as it is, more or less, only he's an in-game NPC, so this is an in-game scripted sorta of invasion. He has two dingleberries to protect him. The guy on the left is a really annoying wizard, the guy on the right is a really annoying knight, and Latrex, the guy in the middle, is a really annoying asshole with some daggers. He uses, he uses I think, a dual show. Oh boy. Whoops, Daisy. Sorry, I was moving around and I hit the dead and I hit my table with my hand. I also got my ass kicked. Thankfully, dying here does not ruin your souls and it puts you back in the bonfire, so that's nifty. Um, I also went in pretty unprepared for that one, so. Oh, right, I'm still wearing this crap. Here, I'm gonna be cool and wear a Silver Knight stuff. This is going to diminish my roll horribly. And let's see what other weapon we can get our grimy paws on and play around with. We cannot use this because it requires 40. Oh, wait, yeah, we can't even use this with two hands. We should be able to play around with this. We can use this with two hands, which... Uh, whap. This is a very nifty weapon because it's supremely overpowered. I'll show you why in a second. Right off the bat, no upgrades or anything, it just does a ton of damage at its base. Its base damage is 245, plus 76 scaling. It requires, uh, yeah, it requires 32 strength and 18 dexterity to use. Obviously, we don't have enough strength, but we can, oh boy, and it's heavy as shit. But we can wield it with both hands. Let's use it without it being a fairy. Look how much it hurts. My first time through the game, this is my weapon of choice. It's a very good weapon, but honestly, it's... I don't know, I guess I felt a little cheesy after using it for a while. Uh, so, uh, I'm hoping, I'm hoping we can get a drop of a, um, what's it, of a Silver Knight Straight Sword. I really like the Silver Knight Straight Sword. So, while we're here, I'm gonna actually switch to, um, a passable parry shield, an actual parry shield. Because, yeah, the target shield and the buckler are both used for parrying specifically. Offer shitty. Pr it's 
So anyway, shitty protection. <laughs> it just makes me laugh. Um, one time I was playing Bloodborne, and I was running up a uh, staircase. The staircase did not show up, mind you. So while the area was loading, I was just running up this invisible staircase over a pit. It was pretty great. But um, anyway, yeah. So target shield. You can see its parry animation lasts much longer, has more parry frames. That's nifty. I might dick around too much, we might not even get to the boss this time. I'm gonna make an effort to at least fight them once and get my ass kicked. Hopefully we won't need like 10 episodes for them. So, go on a buff. By the way, I, fu I fucked up the name of the guy who did the uh, Dumb Shits Guide video. His name is WildPie101. You should check out his videos, they're really funny. And they give very good insight to the ins and outs of this... God damn it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. He's... Oh boy. Oh boy. He's lancing me. Okay. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Oh, get... Get, get your mage ass out of here. Okay, I'm... I'm good at this game. <laughs> oh boy. I always do just hilariously bad in this fight. Just because, like, if it were just Latrec, it wouldn't be so bad, but you have the dummy with the lance and the stupid whiz robe shooting at you, and there's my excuse. That's my excuse. It's three on one. Shut up. I promise I'm I'm the man. I'm the I'm the best in the land. Duh. Well, anyway, might as well showcase the target shield. Check it. That was not a proper showcase. Come on. So, his attack hit me. It was not supposed to have hit me, but, um... You can see how bad my parry timing was, but I had plenty... I had ample time to still... Well, no, that's... It still hit. It still parried him. So you have much greater leeway for parry timing with these things. It's really nice. Um, especially if, um... I'm trying to do this less, but when I go into panic mode, I just start parrying and parrying until something works or I die. I usually die. I don't like dying. Okay, I think we'll do one more fight with Latrec, and we should actually have enough souls to get another level just because we keep killing that one guy by the stairwell. And because this is an in-game summon, or in-game invasion, that that's not, that, that that's redundant. Because it's a scripted invasion, it, take, it takes less time because you're not, excuse me, you're not connecting to an internet connection. Buffity buff buff buff. Not good at blocking. My main concern is not really the mage, it's the stupid knight guy. I go for the mage first because he just has less health. I mean... I was gonna say he falls easy, easier, but I have to hit him first. Oh boy! And not... roll into his shit. Oh boy! Here's something neat you can do. Oh my god! You can heal if you ma- God damn it! No! And I'm dead. So anyway, you can heal with humanity. I hate this fight so much, just because, like... You can just go straight for him, and, you know, kill him. I think more people probably do that, actually. Oh, oh come on. And, um, maybe I should just do that. <laughs> oh, boy, I'm really sorry you all get to witness this uh, grandeur. Okay, what do we want to level up? What do we want to level up? I love the faith. Fuck it, why not? I don't care. Oh, no, I don't care, whatever. Okay, now instead of... Buckler, I'm gonna put on a big boy shield. Eagle shield? Actually, no. Silver knight shield. 
Will this, will this make us fat roll? No. Did I already kindle this bonfire? I have not kindled this bonfire. I need to reverse my hollowing and kindle this bonfire. Because actually you need all the assets you can get from this bonfire. Doi. Okay. So now, you know what? Screw the trick. I'm gonna go straight for the boss. After I knock this joker down a peg. Yeah. I'm really hoping one of these guys will drop a Silver Knight straight sword because I really like that weapon. It's not the best, but I like its moveset. I have fun with it. It's one of my favorite go-to weapons. It's just a just a straight sword with a slightly modified moveset, that's all. Well, I wanted to run into the trees again. Anyway, that's right. I better, um... Okay. Gotta be careful here. I can just run past these guys. Oh, God! It wasn't cool at all. Yokozuna. Alas, a bitch. Okay, so this is great. You get to fight both of these doofuses. Oh my god at once, and also get hit from behind the frickin' doe oh god! Get hit from the fog wall! <laughs> okay. You, you're, you're gonna see why people, why these guys are a big deal. So. The general strategy is frickin' pick one. The strategy against these guys is pick one and go with it. The easiest, it's, it's generally easier to kill Ornstein, the little guy, first, and then kill, and then, well, you'll see. Oh, boy. Ah! Yeah, that was real smooth. Basically, what happens is... <clears throat> You kill one, the other one absorbs the first one's strength, and you have to fight them again with the other one powered up. And their their HP restores fully as well, so that's nice. Um, I think because I'm not using a build I really use that much, this might be a little harder than, use, than usual. I might actually try to switch. I beat them with the Zweihander, okay. Um, on a different game. But, um... You know what? I think we're just gonna take one more crack at, um... <laughs> I'm not very good at that. <laughs> oh, I'm uh, oh my god. The worst part about doing this stupid little skip is just the camera. Uh, I think we're gonna take one more cra crack at Latrek because we're out of time. Um, just gonna go in. But uh, yeah, the next episode or two after I eat it here will be me fighting that boss. Whoopee. Look how much fun we're going to have. Look how much frickin' fun it's gonna be. Okay. So I'll go against this guy with an actual shield. 
can actually use this stupid thing. Come on. Come on, guide. And he's dead. Screw you two, I'm going to- Screw you guy, I'm going home. I can't attack anymore. <laughs> oh, now I can. I was trying to- I was trying to backstab that dummy. Ha! Ha! Eat shit, you stupid mage. Okay. You know what, that, uh, that was worth it. That ended on a high note. <laughs> um, sorry about the technical heck up, heck ups, technical hiccups earlier. Thanks for watching. If if you if you know, of it. hello, hello. <laughs>